Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Tea Time with Tanya. I'm Tanya. How you doing today? Today is Wednesday, the 29th of July, 2020. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Let's start this off with a blessing. Dear Creator, dear Spirit Guides, dear Universe, please give us a blessing for this day, a blessing for the collective to hold on to and carry forward with us this day. A blessing for the collective for this day. A blessing for this day. Okay, let me shovel a little bit more. A blessing for this day. Here we go. This morning's blessing. Look at this tree, guys. It's like it's in spin cycle. This is a blessing without borders. In essence, we are living energy flowing through the ocean of human consciousness, spiritual beings moving through cycles of life, birth, death, and rebirth. We are all interconnected and in communion with each other, no matter how much physical space appears to separate us. Feel the blessed presence of someone you love this moment in your heart. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let me read that again. This is a blessing without borders. Look at this card. This and it's it's kind of similar to as above, so below. This is, this is as above, so below. A blessing without borders. In essence, we are living energy <clears throat> flowing through the, the ocean of human consciousness, spiritual beings moving through cycles of life, birth, death, and rebirth. We are all interconnected and in communion with each other, no matter how much physical space appears to separate us. Feel the blessed presence of someone you love this moment in your heart. Oh my goodness, we are all interconnected. We are all a part of the whole. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. That was a wonderful blessing. Okay, so here's the last two on our vice presidential picks. Now, Biden is going to make his pick coming up here probably around Monday or so. So let's see if we can get it down to the, the, the final two. Uh, let's try to get it before him. So today, I know I've already got a bunch of no's on Kamala Harris, but yesterday on the news, he had, uh, uh, on his talking notes, he had Kamala Harris's name there. So she, he may still be considering her. And even though we got a no on her, um, I'm going to read her against Maggie Hassan. So Kamala Harris is going to be on my left. And Maggie Hassan, who had the last guess, is going to be on the right. So Maggie, these two are the last two. And um, my next reading, we will break it down to the final two. Okay, Kamala Harris and Maggie Hassan. Kamala Harris and the cards are already telling me they're going to be squirrely this morning. Kamala Harris and Maggie Hassan. Kamala Harris and Maggie Hassan. Which one of you will be vice president? Kamala Harris, Maggie Hassan. Which one of you will be vice president? Kamala Harris, Maggie Hassan. Which one of you will be vice president? Here we go, guys. Here we go. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I'm sorry. I got to um, deal him. So Kamala Harris is on the left. Maggie Hassan is on the right. So five, six. And Maggie Hassan, two, three, four, five, six. 
classics. Okay, here we go. Now for Kamala Harris, the first two cards out for her. Oh my goodness, we get the, the Page of Swords, the Spy in the Camp. And we get the star, uh, Lost, Theft, and Abandonment. Mm, doesn't look good for Kamala. Above her. Oh, we got the Eight of Swords, tied and bound in prison. This is this is tied up. This is tied up. Um, and what I'm feeling right now is that try as he may, <clears throat> Biden cannot get over um, the attacks that Kamala uh, put on him to make her his vice president. He can't. He can't get over that because she really, she really, she hurt his feelings. She really did. So, um, but he does, he does have plans for her in his administration. I just had to throw that out there. My guides are telling me this, that, um, yeah, let me finish the draw though. So the, 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 the third card, the goal, the fourth card out, I'm sorry we get the fool in reverse. And now this is Kamala. So the, the fool in reverse, this is a little different. In reverse, the fool is negligence, absence, distribution, um, carelessness, apathy, and vanity in reverse. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Look at this, guys. Tarot gave me a yes on Kamala. Oh, my goodness. Oh, okay. All right. And her final card, she gets the two of, of wands in reverse. Now, upright, this is holding the world in your hands. This is, this is um, examining your, uh, your good fortune, everything that belongs to you. The... The two of wands in reverse is surprise, which I am, wonderment, oh my gosh, enchantment, but it is also emotional trouble and fears. This is interesting. This is very interesting. Okay, so we got a yes for Kamala. That's the first yes we've gotten on Kamala, guys. Okay. Now for Maggie Hassan. Maggie Hassan's first two cards. She gets the Six of Swords, Escape by Water, or Travel by Water. And she gets the Three of Pentacles. This is Secret Meetings. Um, this is Dark Money, too. But this is Secret Meetings, Meetings Held in, in the Dark. Above her, she gets the Seven of Swords in Reverse, the, the Sneak Thief in Reverse. Behind her, she gets the Three of Wands waiting for her ship to come in. Very interesting. Now, Kamala Harris got the Two of Wands, which is holding the world in your hands. And Maggie Hassan gets the Three of Wands waiting for her ship to come in. What is in front of her, she gets Temperance. She gets Balance. And below her, oh my goodness, Maggie Hassan draws the five of pentacles. This is the card that usually Kamala Harris gets. Interesting. Okay, so Kamala Harris is going to move on to our final draw. So she gets the yes and Maggie Hassan gets the no. That is very interesting. Okay, all right. So let's go on to my second question. My second question is... Uh, from Roland, uh, Roland B. And her question is, will there be uh, trouble between the, the, the federal agents that Trump has sent in and the protesters? Will there be, will there be trouble? Will there be like big trouble between the federal officers and the protesters? Will there be big trouble between the federal protesters and the the federal 
the feds that are the feds and the protesters. Will there be trouble between the feds and the protesters? Will there be trouble between the feds and the protesters? Okay, here we go. First card out. Will there be trouble between the feds and the protesters? First card out, we get the fool. Okay, uh, folly mania. Walking off the edge. Crossed by judgment. Oh my gosh. So we get the judgment card. The judgment card, uh... is a change of position, renewal, or outcome. The third card, what is above this, we get the Knight of Cups. Okay, this is a messenger. This is someone that is coming with news. The fourth card, the distant past, there's Donald. We get the King of Swords in, in reverse. King of Swords is is cruelty, evil intentions, perversity, and a breach of faith. This is definitely Donald. Okay. Oh my goodness. I got a horrible feeling. And there's, there it is. Yes. Yes, Roland. Yes. Oh my God. There is going to be, there is going to be something very, very bad that's going to happen between the federal officers and the protesters. Oh my goodness. And I do believe this is this is what Trump has been trying to make happen. The sixth card, we get the nine of pentacles in reverse. The nine of pentacles upright is having more than enough. The nine of pentacles in reverse is a roguery, deception, avoided project, and bad faith. So this, this explains what is happening. Trump is sending those troops in to, to initiate, to ignite the fire. He is, those troops are the gasoline and the match, okay? Those troops are there for one reason only, and that is to escalate Escalate, escalate, escalate. They are there to start a war. I'm going to go ahead and pull 10 cards on this, guys. I'm going to pull the last four. So the seventh card, we get the emperor. Okay. This is, so we, we're, we're, we're in Trump's energy. This is in, we're in his mind. This, the, the emperor is a benevolent man. Okay. But this, this card is what Trump wants his power to be and in sending those troops in sending those mercenaries they are not troops they are mercenaries in sending them into american cities trump is trump is saying i am the supreme leader this is trump's statement of superiority the eighth card out, the environmental factors, we get the Page of Cups, okay? Page of Cups, this is coming in with, with uh, this is news of an emotional matter that will be coming out. The Page of Cups reads, this is a, a fair young man, renderer of service, connected to the asker, a studious youth, news, message, reflection, and meditation. This is a fair young man related to the asker. Oh my goodness, I wonder if Baron might say something to his father about these protests. Well, okay, let me go. Um, there's our, we, we, we get another yes that for this one, Roland, there will be trouble. We get the wheel of fortune. We get karma, karma in reverse. Now, I like to read this karma card in reverse. This is increase of uh, increase uh, abundance. So this is getting more. Okay. And then the final result. Oh my gosh. 
we get the world. Again, in reverse. The world in reverse is inertia, fixity, stagnation, and permanence. So, Roland, yes, 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 there will be, there will be big trouble, big trouble between these mercenaries and the protesters, and that is by design, yes. Um, Trump, what Trump wants to happen will happen. He will start an incident. His... His goon squad is going to ignite. They're going to ignite the powder keg. Okay. The, my last question for today is, for, is by Kinetto33. And this question, I had to change it a little bit. So I hope you, I hope you can forgive me, Kinetto. Um, but I have to ask it in a way that I can actually ask it. So he wanted to know if the first, I don't know if it's a he, they wanted to know if it's the first, second, or third vaccine that will be effective. That's too hard of a question to ask. So I changed the question to will there be, uh, will an effective vaccine be made before the end of this year? Will an effective vaccine be made before the end of this year? That way I can answer this question or, or, or I, can, I can ask this question. Will an effective vaccine be made this year? 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 That's it. Here we go. Will an effective vaccine be made this year? Get the emperor in reverse. It's a good man. Crossed by the nine of pentacles in reverse not in reverse neither in reverse nine of pentacles having more than you need will there be will an effective vaccine be made this year get the king of swords donald shows up I, you guys saw me shuffle the cards oh my goodness canetto Oh my goodness, yes, 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 there will. The fifth card, the recent past events, we get the Six of Cups in reverse. The, the Six of Cups, this is the happy childhood, happy family. In reverse, the Six of Cups reads, uh, the future that will come to pass. The future that will come to pass. Oh my goodness. Yes, guys, there will be an effective vaccine made this year. Oh my goodness, that is fantastic news. The future influence, the sixth card we get, we get the chariot. This is rushing forward, rushing forward uh, as into war, but moving swiftly. So this is saying that this vaccine is being developed and is moving Swiftly, look at this, guys. We get a second, yes. Seventh card. Seventh card, the questioner. We get another yes. This is fantastic. The eighth card, the environmental factors. We get the magician in reverse. Let's read this card, guys. The, the magician in reverse is physical, mental illness, or disgrace. Okay, now the magician is skill, loss, sickness, and disaster. Oh, no, 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 no. This is physician, not physical. This is physician. Okay. All right. So that, that's, that's saying that that's a doctor. Okay. The, the ninth card, the inner emotions. I, I'm sorry about that mix-up, mix guys. We get judgment. Okay. 
we get judgment for the ninth card and the final result we get the moon things things that things things that are that are that are done under the cover of darkness will be shown in the light things will be made clear troubles will be illuminated okay this is fantastic so Hidden enemies, dangers, darkness, terror, deception, error. Okay, that's the final card. But we did, yes, yes, an effective vaccine will be made. And the fact that we got two, two yeses in the fourth and seventh position. The second vaccine, it'll be the second vaccine that will be effective. Okay, guys. Oh, my goodness. All right. Yesterday, uh, Bill Barr got caught lying uh, several times. So that came to pass. His lies that he did will be used against him later, okay? What happened yesterday? I don't know if you guys saw it, but literally, they laid a trap for Barr, and Barr walked into it with his own words, and he made sure he used his own words. So, we will see uh, portions of Barr's testimony used against him coming up shortly. So, all right, guys. All right. Everything is happening. We are less than 100 days out from election. Trump is going to try to do everything within his power to disrupt, destroy, damage, or throw suspicion on the election. He is he's upside down he's underwater with his numbers very shortly he will begin to panic he is losing support the only ones that he has are the base that will never leave him he's not getting new people on his side so Prepare, please. They're lying already about COVID. He is getting on television and basically saying that the pandemic in America is over. Please, please, please. Be as cautious as you possibly can. If he cannot stop the vote, he will try to make America as sick as possible to the point of possibly even shutting down the country come election time if, if he can't figure out another way. So I need everybody to just be aware of all the trickery, the deception and the horrible things that are about, that are about to be done to us to the American people. And I have to say it this way, Donald Trump is about to literally attack all Americans. He really is, it's going to be, it's going to be bad. He's sending these troops into cities. He is going to, he's already messing with the US mail. He's lying about COVID. And there's a lot of things they're trying to rush to get done um, that they're kind of stuck at an impasse. So things are going to get really hairy, guys. Be prepared. Make sure that you have at least two weeks worth of supplies on hand. America is sick. Our... 
our migrant and seasonal farm workers are sick. Sick people that, are, that we expect to harvest daily to bring food to our tables are dying in ridiculous numbers. Nobody is doing anything to help these people. Okay? They don't have health care. They are living in shanties stacked upon each other like cordwood to harvest our fruits and vegetables. So please, take, take a moment. Send love, send energy, send your prayers into the universe for all of our brothers and sisters who are making it so that we can live. We need to support them as much as we support ourselves. I love you guys. I love you. I love you. Please, let's send all the energy that we have to those who need it. Have a fantastic day, guys. Bye-bye.